Baby Race at New Jersey's Palisades Park in 1955 was a unique and entertaining event that brought together infants in a friendly competition. A photo of a large woman riding small bicycle 1935. A photo from 1935 captures an archery competition during the annual Juinalia Student Carnival in Krakow, Poland. Cosmonauts Valery Baikowski and Sigmund Yen returned to Earth on Soyuz 29 in 1978. Baikowski contributed to Soviet space exploration, while Yen participated in international space missions under the Intercosmos program. On October 9, 1956, white women protested against desegregation in front of a church in Fort Worth, Texas, during the US Civil Rights Movement. Dolores Reed, an actress prominent in the 1950s and 1960s, had a portrait session in Los Angeles in 1956 a standard practice in the film industry for career promotion and publicity. Pope John Paul II's visit to the church in Katowice, Poland in 1983 was a significant event, especially given his Polish heritage and his role in promoting freedom and human rights in Poland during the communist era. General Dwight D. Eisenhower, Supreme Commander of the Allied Expeditionary Forces in Europe, inspected soldiers of the U.S. 101st Airborne Division in France on March 15, 1945. A fish store in Hong Kong, captured in 1946. Edmund D. Wright, a lieutenant in the U.S. Navy Reserve, USNR, is seen in this photograph showcasing the nose art he painted for the B-29 superfortress named Jackpot during the time when it was stationed at Tinian in 1944. Slovenian member of the Yugoslav Partisan Resistance during World War II as she awaits execution in 1942. Tragically, she was shot shortly after this photo was taken. The Yugoslav Partisans were a group of communist-led resistance fighters who opposed Axis occupation in Yugoslavia during the war. Lily St. Cyr, a 1950s burlesque star, was celebrated for her captivating performances, blending striptease, comedy and elaborate costumes to define the era's entertainment. In September 1942, crewmen of the USAF Boeing B-17 posed with their high-altitude gear at RAF Polbrook. The photo was taken by Margaret Bork White for Life magazine. In the Kuala Lumpur incident on August 7, 1975, the Japanese Red Army attacked the US Embassy in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. During the attack, a member held two hostages at gunpoint before they were eventually released. Helen Keller, an American author, disability rights advocate and lecturer, is seen teaching sign language to a girl. In 1904, she achieved the distinction of being the first deaf-blind person to earn a Bachelor of Arts degree in 1907. In the 1980s, this photo by Laurent Rebord captured the aftermath in a village along the Salang Highway in Salang, Afghanistan. The village was shelled and destroyed during conflicts between Mujahideen guerrillas and Afghan soldiers. Tsarevich Alexei Nikolaevich and his mother, Empress Alexandra Feodorovna, are depicted in a photograph in the early 1910s. US soldiers from the punitive expedition on their way back to the United States were photographed between Coralitos Rancho 
and Ojo Federico on January 29, 1917. On August 3, 1951, a souvenir stand owned by a Hiroshima survivor served locals in front of the Hiroshima Peace Dome. Dancer Siri Osterholm performed in the ballet Cleopatra at the Royal Opera House, circa 1913. A Finnish soldier manned a Maxim machine gun while waiting for an enemy in Jivalati, Finland, on August 15, 1942. A young samurai from the Satsuma Domain in Japan during the years 1877 to 1880. The samurai were a noble class of warriors in feudal Japan, known for their skills in martial arts and their strict code of honor called Bushido. Zulu tribesmen pulled a tourist in a pedicab in Durban, South Africa in a photo by Melville Chater. It reflects the era's transportation and tourism and showcases the rich cultural heritage of the Zulu people in the 1930s. Hans Langseth, the world record holder for the longest beard at 17.6 feet, donated his beard to the Smithsonian in 1927. In 1958, due to the union of Egypt and Syria, the name of Syria was changed to the United Arab Republic within the United Nations Council. A photograph of a United Airlines stewardess in 1970. An image from 1934 captures the office of the Polish Orbis Travel Agency in Paris, sourced from the collection of the Polish National Digital Archives. Japan surrendered to American forces, marking the end of the bloodiest war in history and the conclusion of imperialist Japan's involvement in World War II. A troupe of young dancers in Indonesia, captured between 1895 to 1915. Reverend Martin Luther King Jr., the civil rights leader, photographed at his church in Atlanta, Georgia, on August 18, 1962. That was all for today, folks. Until we meet again, may your journeys be secure and filled with safety.